And nice enough to join us for our latest uh, walk and talk. We've got Rory McIlroy here as he makes his way up to his drive at the par 5-6. So thanks a lot for joining us, Rory. You're on a nice little roll here with back-to-back -back birdies. I know it's been a long week, so thanks for the chat. First of all, how do you go about playing the par 5-6 on the tee as you break down this uh, longest hole on the card? Yeah, thanks, Dan. Um, so the wind is completely opposite uh, today than it's been the, the first couple of days. Uh, you know, the wind's back off the left. Uh, it was it was pretty much like going off the right for the uh, for this hole the first couple of days. So a little bit of a different tee shot, hitting it up the left, trying to let the the wind sort of you know bleed it back into the fairway. Um, and yeah, I mean this hole is all about the tee shot. I actually haven't hit the tee shot very well here the last few days, but I think I think this one's a little bit better, a little bit further right than this morning. So uh, you know, hopefully I have a, a decent angle and a decent shot into the green. Roy, this is Zinger here. You know, you're second on tour in par five scoring, your birdie percentage and all that. I just wondered if in match play versus stroke play, if there's any different strategy for you? Uh, Zinger, not really. You know, uh, you know, you pretty much just want to get on that tee and, and make it make a four whatever way you can. Hopefully, Sam that Lucas Herbert this morning headed to, headed to about eight feet on me here. So, um, but yeah, this is... Yeah, but not not especially with this green complex. It's just sort of you try to get it on the green anywhere, and you know four is a good score here. And if someone makes a three on you, then you know you just got to take your hat off to them. Rory, it's Kurt. You know one of the things that a lot of people were talking about before the matches started this week was the equipment tweak that you made with your driver, the half inch shorter shaft that you went to. You obviously are swinging the club really well right now. That driver has been the key to winning two of your matches on 18. Yeah, tell us, yeah, yeah, tell us about Kurt. that. Yeah, yeah, I've just got a ton of confidence with it. I just feel, you know, my my bad habit with my swing is to let the club sort of fall behind me in transition. So I feel like with the shorter length shaft, I'm able to keep the club a little bit more in front of me, uh, which means that you know I, I have all the confidence in the world to to release it down the line. So, you know, as the as the days have went on here, I'm with the driver, which is great. Rory just missing the fairway, but this is a 337-yard drive. Yeah, I think putting the ear pods in can be a bit of a distraction. That's always the challenge for the guys that agree to do that. He's got him out now as he plays the second. A perfect angle to try and catch that slope coming in from the left. Even if you go past the hole, it'll U-turn and come back to you. Well left, not cutting at all. And that is problematic to say the least for McElroy. Well, again, I mean, I, sometimes it can be a little bit of a distraction. Rory, what happened on the on the second shot there? Didn't come yeah, off as you'd like. Yeah, just uh, wind was off the left, trying to just hit like a little bleeder forearm in there, and I just double crossed it. Um, right isn't uh, a particularly good miss to this pin, and I think uh, that was sort of in the back of my mind. So. Uh, yeah, not not the best leave. Uh, hopefully, I don't know where it, where it's ended up. Hopefully, it's not right up against the range fence. But you know, hopefully, I can get to do something with it. Hey, we appreciate the conversation, Rory. We'll uh, let you get ready for your next shot. Thanks, guys. All right, good luck down the stretch of today. Again, it's McElroy and Shoffley tied up in this quarterfinal match in Austin. To watch another DP World Tour video, click here, and to subscribe, click here.